Hey, 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 everyone. So today I just want to uh, bring you in on my breakfast. Um, I am making uh, oats uh, pancakes today. So here are the ingredients that we shall be using today. Oats in there and I'm about to grind it into a meal. Let's see. One egg. <laughs> Pinch of salt. One banana, cinnamon, one teaspoon of baking powder, and use your eye, but some coconut milk, okay? And the tools I'm going to be using are a fork and a spoon. And obviously, there's going to be some oil to go in my pan. To start, I'm going to take this and grind it into a meal. Here we go. Okay, so this is what your oats looks like ground up into a meal. I'm going to take that out. Just put it on the side. Take out your meal. And I'm gonna do this in the measuring cup. Pour it into the measuring cup. So we're gonna take the measuring cup and we're gonna pour our meal into that measuring cup. To your meal, you're going to add some baking powder, about a teaspoon of baking powder, and then you're going to sprinkle some cinnamon powder and mix. It's now time for your wet ingredients. One peeled banana and you're gonna mash that. A banana's ready. Over here, don't forget to add a pinch of salt. Mix and back to our wet ingredients. Add egg and just move it around with your fork and damage your dish. If you have a vegan substitute please use that next up you're going to add your wet ingredients to your dry ingredients wet to dry and mix The reason I didn't add the milk is because this um, mixture was pretty wet already. So I'm just going to add a little bit of milk just to make it a little bit more wet to give it that pancake batter consistency, which is more wet than even this. Okay, use your eye. Coconut milk. All right. to give you a nice watery batter like a pancake batter should be prepare your hot pan that is non-stick and we're going to just pour some oil on there any kind of oil that can stand the heat use that kind whichever one you prefer Coconut oil, grapeseed oil. I wouldn't go for avocado though. Cover the base of your pan with that oil. And wait for it to heat up. 
Yep, it's hot. same size as long as they don't bump into each other okay so as you can see bubbles are starting to form on the surface so that means it's cooked through oh see that moves easily now we're gonna flip them hold on a sec <laughs> <laughs> 